Hey everyone, this video is gonna walk you through how to set up a free website using WordPress.com. To get started, make sure you're at WordPress.com. Also make sure your email is already open, logged in, and ready to go. So on the front page, click Start Your Website. You're gonna put in your email address. Pick a username. Then you're gonna pick a password. My username was already taken, so I need to pick a new one. So I'm gonna pick a password. Okay, you have several options. One, uh, you can you can purchase, but there's three free options right here. I'm gonna click for mine at least. I'm, just, I'm gonna click business. You can click blog, business, or professional. I'm gonna make a off-road site, an off-road website. So I'm typing the word Jeep, and it gives me some examples down here. Click continue. Uh, let's. Let's put uh, Nevada Jeep Trails as my business name. And the domain, let's try this again, Nevada Jeep Trails. Of course, you'll be putting something different, something of your own up here. Uh, so it gives me a lot of options here. Uh, most of them are paid. Here is the one free option. So if you're going to build a free site, like I'm setting up right now, click on this one. Again, gives you quite a few options to pay, but up here you can start a free one. All right, hooray, we're done. Uh, so once it's set up, follow these steps. But for right now, I'm going to click launch your site. It's telling me to go to my email uh, email account. It's already open. So right here, I need to click confirm. Once that's done, then I can click launch my site. So again, it's going to try to ask me to pay. I still want a free site. So for right now, I'm going to click skip purchase. Later on, you can always upgrade and pay. But, but let's skip purchase. Uh, we're still skipping purchase, so continue with your free site. That's it. And if you're one of my students, I want you to turn in your URL. Uh, this is not what I want you to turn in. This th this won't help me out very much. Uh, what I would what I need is for you to click on view site, and this is what you're going to turn in. This is your URL that everyone's going to see online. So. You're going to highlight this, copy it, and paste it into Moodle, and that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. Take care.